I choose constant weights because to me it's the purest form of free diving. A diver on a sled has only to hold his breath and equalize his ears. But in constant weight, there's no artificial help. It's just me and the ocean. Every free diver has an intimate relationship with the ocean. The ocean is like a god to the free diver. You talk to the ocean, you pray to the ocean. Sometimes uh, you even hate the ocean. But in the end, uh, you know you cannot live without the ocean. On the day of a record, the outside world doesn't exist for me. 
and completely within myself. When I walk out into the bright sunlight, I'm only vaguely aware of the commotion around me. In my mind, I'm already in the sea. The key to achieving a constant wear record is efficiency. During the dive, I have to conserve every molecule of oxygen in my body by being completely streamlined and absolutely calm. Every movement I make, even every thought I have, will use up precious oxygen. As with every dive, my parents and sister are here, always supportive always worried. My father insists on watching on the water, but he can't swim. We put him in a buoyant wetsuit so he won't drown trying to see my dive. In the last minute, I imagine the entire dive ahead. I feel the ocean absorbing my body. I see myself grabbing the tag at 80 meters, 262 feet. I tell myself I can do this. When I'm finally prepared, I've already succeeded in my mind. I've already descended into the blue infinity below. Following the guideline, I can touch only at the bottom. I signal for the final five minute countdown. Now the safety divers descend. These last five minutes seem like five seconds.
After the record, my deepest safety divers spend a long time decompressing. They're my brothers, and they share in the risks. But they can't share in the celebration above. So I bring the party down to them. Somewhere there are divers who will break the records of Pippin and Umberto, just as they broke the records of Majorca and Mayol. But records are fleeting. In the end, a true diver knows that the essence of free diving is not to challenge others, but to dive deep within himself, and for a few precious moments, to become one with the sea. <laughs> 